Oh, the Commonwealth Games is definitely up there with one of the best things. Um, a squash player, if you're in the Commonwealth, obviously um, you can go to it. It's just an incredible event. Um, you get to represent your country. You get to spend the time with your teammates and just it's just a completely different feeling. You know, you're sharing an event with the sport and it's one of our only chances we get to kind of showcase the sport um, in line with a lot of other sports and get that out there to people that maybe haven't seen squash before. Um, so it always feels so special. And, and to me, I've got some great memories from both of the last two Commonwealth Games that I attended. Um, and as, as I said, it's, it's another chance to represent Wales um, and yeah, do as much as I can for the country as well. Uh, you mentioned your memories. Obviously, you took uh, bronze in, in 2018, the uh, first Welsh woman to, to medal at the Commonwealth Games in squash. Um, mm -hmm. what, what did that feel? You know, what did that feel like for you? And also, how far can you go, you know, above that next year, do you feel? Yeah, I mean, it felt it felt pretty special. I'd had uh, a pretty hard week. Um, I was not sort of seeded to win a medal. It was a tough draw. There was, everyone was playing well. Um, and yeah, it was an absolute special week. It's probably one of the most memorable weeks I've had in my career. Um, and as much, I'm just sort of thinking that I remember coming off against SJ, losing in the semi-finals, um, putting myself forward to try and be in the final. So then you at least guarantee a medal and having to deal with the fact that I might come home and not win a medal. And that was pretty tough, but um, it was so, it was amazing to win that medal. It felt, yeah, it felt pretty special to be honest. Um, and yes, it might not have been gold or silver, but it felt pretty special to come home with a medal. Um, and yeah, I mean, looking forward to the next one. There's a lot of there's a lot of different players in there. Um, a lot of young up and up and coming players that are going to be possibly going to their first games. Um, and, and still, you're going to have you know the, the top players, SJ, Joel, um, there as well. So it's going to be such a tough event. It always is. Um, and yeah, I would love to come home with the medal and hopefully, if I can, try and upgrade the medal if I could. Um, but yeah, as I said, it's going to be a really tough draw and everyone's going to be after the medals. So just, as I said before, trying to go out there and put out my best performances for the week, really. Uh, and on that, obviously, that's in the singles event. Has there been any talk of mixed doubles with yourself and Joel? Yeah, we've been we've been practising um, uh, quite a bit, sort of pre Alguna. Um, and yeah, it's been going really well. We've been, you know, we've been finding our feet. Um, it's a new pairing for both of us. Um, so we're still trying to find our feet and find out what works, but it's been really good. Joel's been great to play with. He's been, you know, really encouraging. Um, and yeah, I've been, been having a lot of fun with it and enjoying myself. So um, that also will give us hopefully another chance to come away um, with a medal if we can. And finally, obviously you were in Birmingham for the one year to go event uh, last week. It's not yeah. quite, I suppose, a home games for you, you know, Wales v England and that. But how excited are you for it to be, you know, only a couple of hours away in Birmingham? Yeah, amazing. Like we we had Glasgow obviously in 2014 um, and that felt like a home games, even though that wasn't as well. But it was a lot further for obviously family and friends. And this is this basically does feel like a home games. I mean, I'm sure the crowd won't agree with that. <laughs> if it's Wales and England, that's not going to be the case. Um but hopefully, you know, there's a lot of people already in the area um, in in the squash world that have already said how excited they are to come and watch. So hopefully we can get as much support as we can um, and make it as much of a home game as we can, because this is probably the closest that we'll have, um, albeit if we ever hosted it ourselves. Um, so it will be amazing, to be honest, to be so close to home and, and have everyone close together. And, and uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty special, I think.